Well, Roger, you're back on the clay. Uh, tell us about the decision to return and why now, why this week? Yeah, I mean, the decision was taken quite uh, a long time ago now. It was, uh, at the end of last year, you know, we were talking in the team about um, the clay court swing, how that was going to impact the rest of the season as well, and also um, the beginning. So uh, I really wanted to take a decision somewhat early uh, within the team already, and then at, at one point let the, let the fans and the press know as well. So um, it was made based on mood, you know, I was in the mood to play again. Um, I was happy to go back on the clay, I was happy to do a build-up on clay. And I was also particularly happy to play uh, at the French Open again, a tournament that I missed, uh, you know, three straight times now. Once because of injury, twice because I, I just felt like it was better for my health and better for my, my life as a family and father and husband. and. Uh, and also for my game, if I wanted to uh, seek uh, to stay in the game, I felt like maybe skipping the clay season was going to help me do that. And, um, and I feel like it did. So I'm coming back this year on the clay uh, with like uh, a good feeling. Um, so far, it's been going really well um, on the clay court, uh, clay courts in practice. And Madrid for me was always a logical week to sort of come back. You know, it gave me enough time after Miami and uh, gives me also enough time before, before Paris. So um, exciting times and I'm very happy to be here in Madrid right now. Yeah, you mentioned a, a logistical thing, a timing thing, but do you think conditions in Madrid suit you as well? Maybe, um, I'm not sure, you know, I mean, altitude is always a, a very interesting uh, place to play tennis in, you know, the ball bounces uh, a lot, it's very lively. Um, that can be good and bad because if you find your rhythm quick and uh, you can just uh, out dominate a player, you know, okay, it's all good. But if you're on the other side, um, it's actually quite complicated to, to turn the tide. So from that standpoint, uh, it wasn't based on Madrid being a faster clay court than others. It would just happen that the week was a better one to come back in. And have you missed it? The clay court? Yeah, I have because I like watching highlights uh, on clay and watching players play on clay. I think there's always the extra element maybe with the drop shot or the angles and the height of the ball that you can play with. So yeah, I, I like playing on clay and it's, uh, it's been fun so far. And Madrid in particular has special memories for you, uh, three times a win on three different sur surfaces. How, how, how helpful is that coming back to a tournament? I, mean, I think it helps, you know, always having one in a place uh, where you're coming back to. So you know how to do it, uh, even though you can't just press, you know, repeat button and just do it all over again. It's a, it's a lot of work, especially uh, this week, you know, have a tough draw, number one, number two, I haven't played on clay for so long. Um, so expectations are extremely low, I'd say, and I'm not saying that to put pressure on, pressure on others, or I'm just uh, seeing it is, as it is. I just don't know where I am at, and if I can win the first round already, that's already nice, and uh, that gives me some info, and that's all I really need for now. And uh, you know, I just hope I don't lose uh, terrible in the first round. That's my biggest fear right now.